hmm, did I almost not did I almost not include you in this important part of my life? <laughs> yeah, ne. I almost forgot to include y'all, but I remembered. So here I am now. Hello, bunny. Welcome to another video. <laughs> Welcome to another moving vlog. <laughs> I know I should be hiding, right? But. I am moving again. <laughs> Welcome to another adulting vlog. At this point, I feel like I'm starting every new year with a moving vlog. Like, I feel like every new year I am moving. <laughs> Hello, Bunny. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Honey, and I do fun, authentic, and most importantly, educative videos. If you're not subscribed yet, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's free of charge, it doesn't cost you anything, but it means the world to me. If you are attending Bunny, y'all know the deal by now. Do not forget to leave a comment in the comment section down below. Leave a like and share the video it's free of charge but it helps youtube push our videos to more people that way we get more subscribers you know and our youtube channel grows so yeah welcome to the channel welcome to another video today is 20 what today is the 24th of december yes today is the 24th of december and i am finally packing to move i am yeah <laughs> i'm so excited about the move i am lying to y'all about the date today is the 24th of january it was my birthday a few days ago so yeah use this opportunity to wish me a happy birthday by the time you see this video it's probably gonna be in february so but anyways i'm excited hope y'all are excited let's move the thing is, I'm so excited about the new place I am moving into because at this point, I think like I'm getting that place name for YouTube. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm getting the place for growth, maturity, and having space for Scarlett. Scarlett can live freely. We can go on walks. We can go on runs, and she can run around the yard. And it's just such a freeing space like i went there and i went to go check out the place and i love it and it's a two bedroom so and it's a whole house by myself yeah i'm excited come come on the journey y'all will see the space once i move in I'm not sure about doing a whole house tour of the new space i'm not sure about that but y'all will get to see the space because i'll be doing a lot of blocking around the space but yeah I don't want you guys to know where I'm gonna be living, so I'm not gonna tell you where I'm moving to, but I am moving to a pretty amazing space community. That's the hint. Anyways, um, let's pack. I already started packing. Let me show you what I packed up so far. What my okay, so we have food items, dishes, and stuff like that in that box um i think so what is in there food storage containers and this is uh <laughs> newspapers and uh, just guys i have a few boxes I, at this point i don't know what is in the boxes apparently but i have one two three four boxes packed up which is mainly the kitchen that's packed up so whatever that was scarlet's carpet and it's packed up this was my um spices and uh, yeah spices were in there that's packed up sing area is packed up so yeah food is packed up i have all my food in that plastic bag there and there's another plastic bag with food i think i put it away so yeah that's the kitchen all packed up so the kitchen is all packed up what i want to do now is clean out my not the kitchen is not all packed up i, I still have pots to pack and then I have to clean the bottom thing where I keep soaps, cleaning stuff. Yeah, and then we're gonna move to the bathroom. So, yeah, hope you're like excited because I'm excited. I am moving. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this spot has gotta go. Like, hmm. Um, 
I've actually had this pen since I was at you now like that's how long I've had this I bought this pen in pep in my second year of you know and it was a pretty good quality pot like if I could find this pot anywhere again I would buy it but yeah it lasted me it had its good run we had our good time but it's gotta go now it's time to go can y'all hear the pots falling everywhere but i was saying i don't know if you guys knew this or not but i had a flat mate i've always had a flat mate like all the apartments that i stayed in i stayed there with a the flat mate and i am finally like going to rent the place where i'm going to be staying by myself so living alone diaries coming you know i'm so excited about the living alone part because it's like I finally get to you know decide how my space looks and feels like without you know influence from anyone I get to live on my own and learn on stuff on my own grow and I'm just excited for the whole journey of living on my own like I've lived on my own before but um yeah do I remember much about those times? Not really. Do I think I grew much in those times? No, because I was just, you know, getting into the habit of being an adult, living away from, you know, home, living away from your parents, living away from um, living under somebody else's rules. So I guess in that first stage of my life, I was just, you know, getting into the world and learning how to live away from a set of rules and making my own rules but now it's gonna be like even more different because yes I learned a few of that but then I ended up living in spaces where I always had someone around but now I am going to be staying alone like alone me myself and I and no one else so yeah I'm ready to see how I'm gonna change as an individual how I'm gonna grow as an individual so I'm excited about that but yeah, let's go back to packing. Yo, hi. Trash, like, yeah, I used to keep this stuff. Well, yeah, but I'm not taking this along. We'll go start fresh. I keep this stuff for in case somebody comes to visit me and they need to take like a doggy bag or whatever, and I do not want them to take along my cute bikes. I'll be giving them stuff like this. So, tips to the girls out there, the home, the adulting hands that buy themselves cute tupperware and then have visitors come and never attend their tupperware store this and keep give people food in here because people never attend your buggies they'll promise to do it but they never do so alternative <laughs> But your love's too original You were anything but too much Baby, did you know that From the moment we fell in and knew we couldn't fall back Knew I'd always crawl back mm -hmm. Cause baby, it's the everything hope y'all can hear me but <laughs> my small sister is busy on my instagram stalking me and she finds this like can y'all believe i was this size at a like wait what even i can't believe i was this size but hmm i've grown let me show you this way this way 
this way. Look at how small I was. Can you believe it? I was so tiny. Yo! How do I go from being that tiny to that size? I don't think there's that much of a difference, but damn. Side by side, I was a tiny girl. Anywho, let's get back to cleaning the kitchen carpets. <laughs> Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends, but you know that I do not depend on nothing or no one. So why would you show up so uninvited? Last topic. Like that, please don't take this personal. But you ain't shit, and you ain't special till I made you so. You better act like you know that I've been through worse to you. I just can't keep running away. But I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need We are done with cleaning the carpets. I think we are done with the kitchen. The things up there, Did you clean Scarlett's place? Yeah. The only thing I'm left with cleaning is the microwave. I need to clean my microwave. So, yes, when I am moving, like I do a deep clean of everything because when I get there, I just want to put things in their places and like clean again. <laughs> But like minimal cleaning, not like deep, deep cleaning, just like wiping people's hands for carrying my stuff. Don't <laughs> say that. <laughs> but yeah, that's the type of cleaning I do on that side. And on this side, I really try to do like a proper deep clean. So now I need to clean the microwave. It's mainly just dirty, like the glass outside. That's what I need to clean. And then from there, we're done. we'll be done picking with the kitchen and then I can get started with picking, putting away Christmas deco and basically picking my bathroom and then my bedroom. It's so weird, ne? but I think I can finish picking my whole entire space in one day. Like, I don't have that many stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have a lot of stuff. Like, I wouldn't call myself a minimalist. I'm far from that, but... I don't have a lot of stuff. And you also throw away a lot. Yeah, and I always throw away stuff. So, that's that. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. When, I don't know what I'm doing, but when I feel like talking to y'all, I'll put you guys up. I'll holla at y'all. Holla at y'all. Look at my lashes. There's something there. Let me, let me just remove it yeah i got my lashes done by glamour glamour yeah glamour holly no i think i, I think it's just glamour hair salon Glam, glamour i'll leave the link here but they did my lashes cute i know it's giving When I, uh, I was talking to my neighbor, she's greeting, you know, compliments of the new year and asking about Scarlett. We just met today, this whole year. <laughs> yeah. But 
Um, I was saying I cleaned my fridge when I came back from my holiday. So lucky for me, I do not have to clean the fridge. It's very clean. Let me show you. The fridge is mostly clean. Um, I just have to wait for that ice to melt and then wipe it out. And everything else is just basically chilling in the fridge. This is my very empty fridge, y'all. <laughs> it's January. Anyways, um, yeah. So basically, I'm just gonna wait. Maybe cook the eggs tonight and then everything else is just gonna be there like that until I have to move then I'll take them out and put them in something. I probably have to clean the bottom because ooh, the bottom is not that clean. The bottom is the one plate, place I didn't clean but so I guess I'm just gonna wait for, for it to melt or, and then clean that part so the fridge is not that clean after all because this is not giving, show me this is not giving clean fridge, let's give it dairy fridge <laughs> see the bottom is stuck yeah that's stuck yeah <laughs> i was lying when i said i clean i didn't clean the bottom I the top. let her go i guess we're gonna cook this meat tonight Moss. we can cook this meat tonight no hmm we're gonna cook this ribs tonight for dinner okay moving to the bathroom moving on to the bathroom the bathroom is probably the easiest place to pick up because we don't really keep anything in the bathroom we just don't keep anything in the bathroom i need to take this comb here this is my shower comb um and then i need to take this this and this and yeah my toothbrush but the toothbrush is gonna stay because i still need to brush my teeth tonight and Tomorrow morning, so that's there. My face cloth is also stained. So yeah, basically just taking this. Ooh, I'm not about to break that now because I'm working with my with one hand. And then uh, this is the rest of the bathroom. So this normally stays in the shower. We just took it out. So hmm, just need to put this in one space to be my, I guess. I'm gonna put it with my toiletries. This is my bathroom candle. <laughs> you guys, the candles are gonna be my new thing in my new house because I'm gonna enjoy bath time so much, ne? <laughs> y'all, y'all need to wait and see the new place, ne? Because yeah, we're throwing this away. This is just toilet paper. We're not gonna throw it away. It's still usable, very much usable. It's toilet paper mouthwash i love this mouthwash because it doesn't leave like a strong aftertaste in my mouth love it it's in pep by the way <sighs> okay Yo guys, I need a break. Okay, so we're done with the kitchen. We're done with the bedroom. <laughs> Those are only two things. No, we're not even done with the bedroom. We're done with the kitchen and the bathroom. 
we have to do the bedroom I'm just so tired but what time is it it's still talk very early I'm not they traditionally wait for how is that you yeah, uploaded this on my status on your on my status okay. on TikTok I actually fold this properly right hey 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 the tradition wait for how is that not fold bro can anyone actually fold this properly so if y'all see that on TikTok, just know that it was not me that posted that. <sighs> okay, um, it's still early if we're being honest. Y'all can't see the time on that whatever, let me see. Oh my screen savers look like that anyways. It's 6.15. Uh -huh. 6 52 like a few minutes to 7 I think I can rest a bit like I, I, I end it I end the rest so I'm gonna rest a bit I'm gonna scroll on TikTok and I'll be back after I scroll on TikTok so let's see it's 6 52 now I'll be back at 2 minutes past 7 hey <laughs> hey yeah hmm <laughs> Let me just show you the time. <laughs> I was supposed to be back here like a very long time ago. I said I would just take a 10 minute break. Tell me why my 10 minute break ended up into a how many hours? An hour, yeah, literally an hour long break. So. From 10 minutes to one hour, I was on TikTok, I was on Instagram. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was up to. <laughs> I was up to no good, y'all. Nothing, nothing, nothing productive at all. It rained a little. I don't know if it is still raining. Hey! So, uh, today the Namibian is most playing. The Brave Warriors are playing today. Now I'm just like curious. It smells like it's going to rain. So I'm just like, uh, is everybody just going to be at City of Venduk while it's raining? Like out in the open. Because like everybody likes going to the games and like everybody is there right now. And it smells like it's raining. Like I know it's going to rain in a few minutes. Or like it's going to rain. <laughs> I just like, yeah. Mm -mm. Anyways, um, let's hope it doesn't rain because we don't want your boyfriend's most to get wet. <laughs> yeah, all boyfriends are at the game watching the game, so we don't want them to get wet. So we're not going to hope it rains, but yeah. Anyways, I'm also just here and there, like, okay, rambling real quick. Like, guys, I kind of relate to the hands that are out there watching the games. Like... I'm a Namibian. I love being a Namibian. I'm a proud Namibian. I love and enjoy sports. Like, I love watching sports, especially if it is something as big. But I just, I'm just not like, like this time around, my energy is just not pulling towards taking my cute little face and going to watch soccer in the open. And yes, I don't own a TV. And I don't even think that if I owned the TV, I would be playing the game. Like, I feel like I have a laptop. So if like I wanted to watch the game, I'll probably go to some streaming website and play the game. And watch the game. But, yeah. And also, nobody invited me. Yeah. The first time around, like the Sunday, that game... <coughs> Sorry. The game that was playing at 10, like some, a lot of people invited me and I said no. So I'm guessing people are like, I'm not going to invite her again because she said no and most. But I also don't think I would have went even if somebody invited me. So also none of my friends are going, so I'm not going to go away. Yeah. <laughs> and even if I just, you know wanted to be that person and go i just i don't know y'all 
I'm just not feeling the energy. Like the vibes are not vibing. Like I do not have. Like I'm not excited about it. Like that. Like obviously I'm going to Google if we want the game. Like after the game ends. Like I'm going to Google. Because y'all are not posting it on your statuses. To tell us whether they, we want the game or not. Y'all are posting. Y'all preparing yourself to go to the game. You are posting yourself. Watching at City of Venduk. But nobody is posting whether we lose or win. Like, I I have to keep going to Google to find out if we lost or we won. But yeah. Anyways, uh, let's continue to pack. Let's continue packing. Let's continue packing. This camera focused on me. Hello, y'all. So today is finally moving out day. Today is yeah. Huh? I'm coming. Today is the 25th of January. It's the next day, guys. Yesterday it got hectic okay i was determined to finish packing so i put the camera away to continue packing i finished packing around 10 o'clock going to 11 o'clock and then this morning i woke up early and i cleaned the fridge i'll show you guys the whole progress but yeah i'm home um i went to work so i had a full work day today and i'm not working tomorrow so i can have a full you know like moving in days since today is moving out so yeah let me show you the progress and everything i have picked up like i have a lot but i don't think it's a lot i feel like it's just bed picking that's making it look like it's a lot but let me show you then you guys can judge for yourself so this is like the kitchen stuff if the phone i hope the camera is in by the way this is the kitchen stuff you see what I mean by bed packing, like that needs to find a space, right? The supports, and then we have, you see, bed packing, too many small stuff. Bed packing, too many small stuff. Like, this is a bedroom, kitchen, whatever. Everything is so mixed up, by the way, ne? Yo, you see, like, these are clothes, bedroom stuff. It's really just bed packing. Yeah, but I cleaned the fridge. I left it open so that it can get nice and dry. And now I can close it and put those back into the fridge. So yeah, that's my luggage. Yo. Um, okay, it doesn't end there. Bed picking, guys. Bed picking. These are clothes and stuff. That's my handbag. It's fine. Like, too many small boxes. Too many small stuff that's that is trash that's fine yeah um more clothes again bed packing just 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 yeah i didn't do a good job this time around with packing and uh, yeah
focus on me.